You're getting subway juice on you. That's very New York. Yeah, I know. So we're heading down to Williamsburg for lunch. Taking the subway down there on the way down. We're going to get in a quick game of truth or dare, have a little fun. Beautiful New Yorkers here. Truth or dare? Truth. Your first at bat this year. Came against Max Scherzer. Yeah. Chase a slider, first pitch. Yeah. What's going through your head at that point? Well, I just wanted to get the first hit out of the way. It was kind of just like, oh, wow, I'm here. Took a big rip at that, with that first swing. It's like, hey, Max Scherzer did what Max Scherzer does by making it not be there. Thankfully, I got the first one out of the way my last at bat. Looped into center field. That's going to fall for a base hit. Pete Alonzo with his first big league hit. We'll go to uh, another truth. What's the scouting report on Tebow, the baseball player? I'm not going to give it away because he's a former teammate. I don't want to give away his thing, but I'll give you a fun fact. He does not believe in the baseball gods. How does that play out for them versus most people who do believe in the baseball gods? Guys that have been in the game for a while, it's like they, they know it's the baseball gods are a thing. Our shortstop made this unbelievable diving catch. I said something like, oh, baseball gods or something about it. It's like, uh, they're going to do them right. And he's like, what the hell are you talking about? Or what the heaven are you talking about? Because it's Tim talking. Next pitch, he whacks a double off the wall, and I just kind of look at him smiling. He didn't talk to me for the rest of the day. You got the football gods? Nope. No football <laughs> gods. All right, Pete, truth or dare on this stuff? Do a dare. I've heard you have a pretty good New York accent. So the dare is I want you to approach someone on the subway and ask for directions to City Fields with this great New York accent that I've heard about. I got to get. Hey, excuse me, sir. Can you do me a huge favor? Can you give me directions to City Field? Because I don't know if I'm in the right direction or not. I don't care if you're a fan or not. I just need directions to City Field. I don't care, bro. It's New York, man. <laughs> just please, out of the kindness of your heart. Give me money. Money? <laughs> yeah, bro. Money? Money? What do you want to do, truth or dare? I just did a dare, so I'll just do, I'll do a truth to mix it up a little okay. bit. Can you outlift everybody on the Mets? Probably not. I mean, Noah gets after it. I mean, Buffalo's a really large human being. I mean, I can move some weight around for sure, but if anyone, probably Buffalo. Yeah? I'll put this in there. Noah bruises like a peach. You got a little bit of time. You got another chance for a truth or dare. What do you want to do? I'll do a dare. I was hoping you'd say that. You know, you're kind of a new star in New York. The dare will be complete when you give them your autograph and when you get them to sign this Mets hat in exchange. Hey, do you want my autograph? Who are you? Pete Alonzo. A monstrous home run off the bat of Pete Alonzo. First baseman for the Mets. Really? Here, pull up a picture on your phone. I believe you. I'll you believe sure? You. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll, I'll like the autograph hat. No, no, no. You're supposed to sign this for me. What if I sign your jacket right there? Beautiful. Can you sign this for me? That's a sweet sig. Let's go Mets. Let's go. Let's go Mets. Truth or dare, Pete? Uh, truth. What do you think about the nickname Polar Bear? I love it. I mean, Todd was just kind of messing around, and he was just like, you just look like a big damn polar bear. And I'm just like, all right. So we made it to Brooklyn. We have one more dare for you okay. before we're done here. We want you to give a polar bear hug to the next person who comes to the turnstiles. Might get punched in the face. <laughs> <laughs> I dare you to scream it. Yankees suck! Yankees! <laughs>